10 People Who Got Rich From Stupid Products Welcome to ALUX.com, the place where future billionaires come to get inspired. Hello again Aluxus and welcome to another fantastic ALUX original video. Throughout our history, there have been many great inventions that have leaped the world forward. These include the ingenious products we use every day to make our lives easier. And then there are products and inventions that have no use and should universally be regarded as very stupid. That is our focus for today, insanely stupid products or ideas that made people ridiculously rich. So without further ado, here are the 10 people who got rich from stupid products. Number 1. Wishbones – Lucky Wishbone Company Traditionally, wishbones are considered to be lucky, technically. Wishbones taken from the meat of an animal are said to be broken by two parties with each taking one side and pulling. The luckier party is said to be the one who has the longer part of the bone. The problem with the Lucky Wishbone Company is that they sell wishbones that are not actually real bones, but instead fake plastic ones at a dollar each, earning the company a ton of money. Number 2. iFart – Joel Com. We know some of you have paid for this one. The iFart, for those of you not known to it, is pretty self-explanatory. The app is your digital whoopee cushion with a fart sound at the touch of a button. The 99 cents app has garnered 600,000 downloads with features such as sneak attack, fart a friend and record a fart. The pointless app has made Joel Com and his company InfoMedia a total of $400,000. Number 3. Fetal Greetings Fetal Greeting is a website that lets pregnant women surprise their friends, family and even the expectant fathers with the news. The website provides surprise cards with illustrations to give to the father and family. The Insane product has earned Fetal Greetings more than a million dollars in sales. The Insane product has sold millions of cars globally with continued sales year upon year. Number 4. Eternal Reefs in what is the insanely booming death business, Eternal Reefs provides for past people the chance to lie in eternal seas. The company provides for an ecological friendly urn that houses the person's remains with holes in the urn for plant growth. Family members can also imprint their hands or attach mementos to the urn to make it unique. The product provides for Eternal Reefs half a million in profits every year. This makes Jack Geller's dream of being buried at sea a reality. Number 5. A pet Rock In what is a ridiculous item on this list, the Pet Rock is a common rock with googly eyes that is meant to be the ultimate pet. With a hold box and training manual, the Pet Rock became a fad in 1975 but died out in a year. But this was not before earning its creator over $2 million with the item becoming a hit prank for Christmas. Number 6. Doggles Doggles or dog goggles take prime spot on this list as a very idiotic product. The goggles look the same as human goggles in design with the same exact nose bridge in the middle. The insanely stupid product goes for $80 a pair and has earned the company a whopping million dollars. Talk about a product that should never have been invented. Number 7. Excused Absence Network in what will admit we would have used in college, the Excused Absent Network provides its customers an authentic looking excuse note for schools, colleges or even offices. The $25 note is either a very authentic looking doctor's or hospital note. This is perhaps the stupidest product here on the list. Number 8. Slinky The beloved but pointless product was invented through a very clumsy mistake. Its creator, Richard James, was working as an engineer in the Navy when he dropped a tension spring and watched it slink away. This gave birth to the product that earned James $250 million in overall sales. Although James later had a midlife crisis and ended up joining a cult and leaving his wife, his wife Betty managed to save the company and sell it for a huge profit in 1998. Number 9. Santa Mail Santa Mail was Byron Reese's brainchild idea of turning a beloved Christmas legend into a capitalist business by kids' beliefs. Reese charges parents $10 for every letter he writes as Santa to their kids. Additionally, Reese bought a postal address in the North Pole to authenticate his letters. 
The idea has earned the idiotic yet lucrative service over a million dollars. This deplorable idea also gives rise to the issue of taking advantage of the sentiment of kids but dissolves because of the naivety of their parents. Number 10. I can has cheeseburger. An entry that symbolizes the consumerism in memes that I can have a cheeseburger cat meme became insanely popular. It gave rise to the already exploding cat craze on the internet. It also spawned into various other memes and pictures. The website dissolved into a page of funny cat pictures and was bought eight months after it came online for an insane $2 million by a group of investors. This concludes our list for today. Yes, we were as shocked as you were at some of these products. But it goes to show that consumerism knows no bounds with so many people wasting so much money on the most idiotic of ideas. We also deem it very important to mention the alarming yet large amounts of similar stupid yet successful ideas that had to be sifted through. And that is why we ask this question to our viewers today. Can you name another multi-million dollar stupid idea that garnered widespread success despite increasing stupidity? Because you stuck with us until the end, we'll share a new one with you. It's called Potato Parcel. It's a small business where you can mail your friends physical potatoes with custom messages written on them. The founders were even featured on Shark Tank. Thank you for spending some time with us, Aluxa. Make sure to subscribe to our channel so you never miss another video. We also handpick these videos we think you might enjoy. Or head over to our website to connect with luxury enthusiasts as yourself. See you inside.